Thanks, Carcona. In the last 26 years, 244 women in Ireland have lost their lives to violence perpetrated by men. The question so many women are asking is how do I begin to feel safe again? And how can other women in Ireland feel safe? There has rightly been a course of calls for more action by the government and the end of a culture of departments saying this is not my department. I am talking about the Department of Justice, Children, Health and other departments as to have responsibility for which part of the services for victims of domestic, sexual and gender based violence. I am calling unilaterally for accountability. We have heard from campaigns for women for, and children's safety in recent days and the joined up approach of women and child safety is long overdue in Ireland. Over Christmas, I was speaking to a person that came home from Canada. She was in a local village when a group of 11 and 13 year olds heckled her on her way to the shop. There was people on the street and not one person came to her aid. Is this the norm in Ireland? Is this the norm in our towns and villages where we see people being heckled, women, children, elderly people, and nobody comes to their aid. Today, I give my sincere sympathies to Ashley Murphy and her family. And there is no words that I can say that will make it any better for their, for their family. But it is our job to make sure that we do everything possible that this perpetrator is brought to justice and for the future of the safety of women in this country, we have to protect them and all people in society. And what is the answer to the departments and commissions? Last week in Limerick, Limerick City and County Council got fined €110,000 for cameras in public places by a commission. The same cameras that we asked for to protect the people in this country because of lack of Gardaí and lack of accountability from government. 110,000 euros, Minister.